What's your excuse? Hey YouTube, it's Wolf Will Development, and this is my 134th weekly update. As you can tell, I am back to training and feeling much better about the entire situation. I do need to preface everything by saying my weights are not where I want to be at all. Uh, having those couple weeks off and not really uh, training as much as I'd like to did significantly uh, dampen my strength levels, especially in my squat. My squat went down. Everything went down a lot. Uh, a lot more than I thought it would, but I'm thinking it's just one of those things, uh, you know, with time it'll all, I apologize, it'll all come back pretty quickly. Uh, you know, for instance, I was deadlifting and like 315 felt like hell to me, and I was just like, whoa, what is going on, you know, and, and squats, like, get a 200, I was like, Jesus, I'm like, I just hit 291 just two weeks ago and it felt great. It's just me getting back into it. Um, part of it is my shin was acting up a little bit, I think from tightness, because I was sort of babying my knee from the injury I had. Check out my Instagram and you'll see uh, the injury I was nursing on my my knee from when I fell the other week doing kegs, but it's good now. And uh, overhead press is, you know, it is what it is. Which, uh, speaking of knees, finally went out and got some knee sleeves. I have been training for on and off about seven years. 15, 15, then it's five, six, seven, about eight years actually. I've been training on and off, strength training, and uh, you know, non, uh, non consensual cycling. I didn't want to cycle, but it was a point in my life where I was sort of forced to be a cyclist for a while there. I uh, kind of got into it a little bit though. And uh, now I'm back into strength training, obviously, and I've, I've, I've gotten the strong man bug. Regardless, I uh, got the new sleeves, talked about it on my Instagram how I'm going to do a review of them. I got Elite FTS sleeves because they are, uh, number one, it's a big name in strength training, Elite FTSs, on top of the fact that their sleeves are $38 for the uh, just kind of standard sleeves. And I was, gonna, I was looking at Ray-Bans, or Rebans, I don't know how to say their name, and they want like $38 for one sleeve, so I was like, hmm. I'll eventually get them just because they're like the strongman standard and I need something else to compare them to, but for now it's going to be the one sleeve set and I'll let you know how they work out uh, as the weeks go by and I said I need to do a little mini rant on reviews. I think I may have already done a rant on reviews, but I want to do another one because I can't say it enough. And so looking for the numbers to jump up, so I discussed switching my training up a little bit and I have gone to what I have dubbed KISS training, K-I-K.I.S.S. Keep it simple, stupid. Just don't overcomplicate things. I'm doing basically a simple 5x5 five five for my first four weeks. Then I'm going to change up the rep schemes a little bit while still keeping the movements the same, you know, the squat, deadlift, and I'm overhead pressing, pressing twice a week, one heavy day and one light day. Uh, just a little bit more volume on one of the days than the other. A uh, little bit less rest on my volume days is the only difference, but I think training the movement twice a week is going to help me increase increase it a lot faster because it's the one movement where I'm, I'm the most desperate to get right now. Deadlift, I'm like, that's going to come up as it comes up. But overhead, I really want that bad. Also incorporated a lot more pull-ups into my routine twice a week also. Uh, because I think pull-ups are cool. I've talked about that before, regardless. Other than that, not much going on this week. Check out the link to the description and below, in the description below to the stone video I released earlier in the week. On Wednesday, I never remember which one it's, it is, but it's one of them, so I hope it helps. Uh, thank you to all the new subscribers, and thank you to the individual who reached out to me on a private message inquiring and trusting me for my opinion about training with a heart condition. It means the world to me. It really does. You know who you are. And if anybody ever has any questions on any stuff like that, number one, I'm not a doctor, but two, I am willing to give you my opinion on things. 
uh, when it comes to training with a heart condition. I know there's not a lot of us, so you know we got to stick together and we got to we got to work together. And if you don't contact me when you've got some kind of question, you know, seriously, you know what's coming. What's your excuse? Thank you.